everybody, thanks so much for tuning in to Bogues Life with Brit Bogues. I am so excited to kind of talk about uh, this next or today's topic because it's something I kind of get asked often um, and it's also something that I recently spoke about on a panel. Um, last month I was asked to be on a panel for EmpowerCon. Um, it was a big conference um, here in Charlotte um, that really focused on empowering everyone. And so I love the message behind it. Um, the creator, Meredith Dean, really love her and her um, spirit, her creativity. So um, it was really great to be a part of the first one. Um, but also the panel that I spoke on was really cool. The topic was failing forward. And as an entrepreneur, um, the journey is full of ups and downs, failures and wins. And so like that was like seriously the best topic for me and something um, that I was like proud to speak on and it actually inspired today's topic which is are you ready to be an entrepreneur and when do you kind of know when is the right time to take the leap of faith and so like that kind of came up a lot um, during our panel um, Q&A session um, there were a couple of people in the audience that were like ready to start their own um, business or you know were very interested and kind of wanted to know um, you know if they're ready and the kind of thing is I mean it's it's everyone's own personal journey um, entrepreneurship isn't for everybody um, and that's like very true um, but there are some like signs or little successes that you can see in yourself that might tell you if you would be um, really good at being an entrepreneur and so um, I kind of narrowed it down to um, five um, things and so yeah so the first one is you're a leader. Um, I think that a lot of entrepreneurs, um, they don't maybe even realize that they're leaders, but they are leaders. Um, people are inspired after they, um, you know, hear them speak, they're encouraged and they feel empowered. Um, and that's what it means to be like a good leader. Um, someone that empowers the people following them, um, not like really a dictatorship. And so like, you're actually a good leader. That might be a sign that you can be a really good entrepreneur. Um, also, um, second, I would say customer service is more important to you than profit. Profits. Um, I definitely say that, especially in the business that I, I'm in, um, relationships matter more than anything. So if it sometimes means, uh, you know, cutting back or or having to, you know, whatever the um, whatever the case may be, um, whatever's in the best interest of your um, customer, even if it costs a little bit of profits, is worth it to maintain that relationship and to believe in your product enough to do that. And so that could definitely tell you if you would be a good entrepreneur um, if you're willing to put your customers before profit. Um, three, I would definitely say passion. Are you passionate about what you're doing? Is it something that you can eat, breathe, sleep? I mean, is it something that you could do all the time? Because essentially, as an entrepreneur, you're kind of always on, especially in the first five years of business. You are um, the face of your business. You're growing it. You're out. You're meeting people. Um, so really, like, um, you got to be passionate about it. And I would definitely say um, you could look at the growth of your side hustle. So a lot of entrepreneurs start by having like a full time job and a side hustle. So number four would definitely be like it will get to a point that your side hustle will get so large that it's taking up a lot of your time. And if that becomes like the case, then it would lead me to number five, which is at some point you have to take that leap of faith and go for it. If, if, if you have all the signs, you're unfulfilled at work and you know, you're believing in this, you're making a profit of it, but you're also maintaining clients and it's just, it feels right. Go for it. Um, you know, that's when you might be ready. Um, and so those are definitely the um, the top five like signs I would say that you might be ready to be an entrepreneur. Um, but I'm definitely open to comments, so please make sure you comment below. Um, and also make sure that you like and share different topic ideas. I'm always open for that. Um, but thank you so much for tuning in. Um, wait to the next one. And make sure that you like, follow, and subscribe. Thanks so much for tuning in to Books Life with Brit Books. See ya.